Anyway, it's at 7 o'clock uh, this Tuesday night. It should be a lot of fun. Um, no, it's really, really great. What, wait, what are you doing, old Kairos? Oh, well, I'm actually using the power of word-of-mouth advertising to get the word out about Kairos Grace Ministry. Well, that seems like a lot of work. New Kairos has a whole marketing wing that's all about spreading the word via email, Facebook, Twitter, and viral videos. What's a viral video? <laughs> anyway, I, I hope to see you there. It should be a really great time. 7 o'clock. Yes, 7 o'clock sharp, the 30 to 40 faithful show up at Grace and... Oh, only 30 to 40? We have been topping 100 people at Kairos for like the last month. And uh, we begin by having all the newcomers stand up, introduce themselves, and uh, share their relationship status. Relationship status? I don't remember that. Yes, I actually think it would make life a lot easier if we did things like that. Oh, you're still bitter about that time that you flirted with that girl that was actually engaged, aren't you? Then, uh, then we usually listen to uh, Nick Larson play a few tunes on the piano before we begin. Who is Nick Larson? Then Clark delivers a very applicable talk about uh, real issues that people in their 20s are dealing with. Oh really? That sounds nice. Right now Clark is going through a six month series all about life after death. Well then of course after Kairos, three or four of us go out for barbecue wings and water at the local Applebee's. Well there's about three dozen of us going out to karaoke after. We go to a place where there's a stage and fog and full blown lights and everything. It's a great time. I wonder if Applebee's has some fog. Oh, Aaron Norton. Oh, it's Aaron Norton. Uh, you should really come to Kairos. You should totes come to Kairos. Who's Aaron Norton? Yeah, moving my hips like yeah, woo!